I'm so happy to see you. I'm so happy to see you. Congratulations on the book. Thank you very much. It's a big deal. I'm grown up. Yes. I've lived a life. I've written a book. Yes. You've written a book. Is it yeah. out? People can buy you this think, and read You know, this. you thought NFTs were the thing. Here's the new thing. It's called a book. It's out now. Wow. Get it. This you can hold it. News. You can hold it. You can cuddle it. Yep. You don't even have to read it, Jimmy. Just take it with <laughs> just, you yeah, places. Just, it's a physical Carry it thing around. People that, yes. will like you better. Yeah. Now, it, if you could look to look camera to and just say link in bio really quick, because. Yes. <laughs> well, I mean, I, I, this is interesting to me because I we, I looked at your IMDb page, and uh, link in bio, and uh, you have link like. In bio. Oh, Let's do a, bo a you, boomerang. You have almost. <laughs> <laughs> you have. Oh, we're doing a live boomerang right now. This is. <laughs> you have 120, um, uh, over 120 credits on different things you've done. I th would say that you're famous, not I fame. No, I'm kind of a big deal. <laughs> that, that, that but here's, been, the, here's the, the thing, yeah. and uh, I, here's what I get. Do I know you? And I'll go, yeah, it's from TV and movies. And they say, no. <laughs> really? No, it is. Do I know you from Carpool? No. <laughs> I don't live in the city. <laughs> I'm not with in your, you? yeah. yeah. No. That's like what the book is about is like the flip coin of that. The glamour one day, the, you know. Yeah, the reality the next day. Oh, how's, da how's dating? I know you're dating. I'm trying. You're not, why? Is this just... guy, okay. Tell me, give me a couple examples. Tell me what you think about this. Tell me, I'll this tell you. This guy yes. picks me up at the laundromat. <laughs> okay, I don't, and I'm I had not, I'm not a... I was like, I still got it. You know what okay, I mean? Because sure. I'm dressed like in sweats and leggings. He was stalking me at the laundromat. Oh. He pulled up and I had a mask on. He said, take your mask off. I want to see your face. Wow, that's kind of... Creepy? Well, Hot. I was going to say like, Brad, I was like Bradley Cooper. And I was like, I, want, I can't want to get another look at you. Like that type of thing. Right? Yeah, it's like kind of sexy. That's what I thought. Sexy, yeah. I was like, that's kind of Take your mask off. I want to see your face. He was like, let me show you, you my face. And yeah. then <laughs> we went out to tea outside. Oh, that's nice. It is nice. And then... I told him I was a comedian, and he looked me up and down. He said, tell me a joke. <laughs> and I said, you're done. I'm done with you. You can't. What do you do there? I will no longer. And then I went on another first date with a guy. He told me he was going to stop at the grocery store and get fancy salads. What girl doesn't want a fancy salad from the grocery store? I'm in. He shows up. <laughs> he shows up <laughs> with one Subway sandwich. Joking. Joking me. What are you doing? Yeah, what? I am your queen. <laughs> Give me a couple choices of sandwiches. Get me all the sandwiches. Yeah, you're at Subway. Get me all the chips. Get me all the cookies. What, how, what does that say about our future together? Yeah, no. What are we That's doing not, you know, here? I'm sorry they have to do with that, that, that type of stuff. But I, you, you, I don't think you'll have a problem. Come on. Can I tell you something? Yeah. Um, I'm can I take it down for a minute? Sure. I don't know. I don't mean just cut yeah. that part out. No. Um, and I really am. I'm serious. Okay. I lost my mother recently. Oh. I'm but sorry. I'm bringing that. Thank you. I'm bringing that up because she was always very proud of me and proud of my career. And so I want to dedicate being here to, to her. Thank you. Thank you. Hello, and I know. I'm sorry about that. And you know. I'm sorry. She loved you. I she loved you. She she liked Leno better. Um, <laughs> And yeah, Letterman was her favorite, he's but funny, yeah. she did. You were in there. You yeah, were in the mix. I was on the mix. That's you were in the all, mix. Yeah. Uh, I'm, 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 I'm happy that you, you, you dedicate this to, to, to your mom. Um, she would have been very proud of you, and that this book is out. Uh, I, I want to say, the one chapter that made me laugh was you have a whole chapter dedicated to Harrison Ford. Yes. Because uh, you worked with him, and you made like. A... Okay. Here's what happened. I worked with Harrison Ford on this movie. We had a lot of scenes together, and we were, I, know, I wouldn't say buddy, we had a little bit of a bond. He yeah. was nice, I, I felt like he trusted me. We ate snacks together. And then one day he said, are you going home for the weekend? And I said, we're in Vancouver, I live in LA, what do you mean? Are you going home for the weekend? I said, no. Do you want a ride? Okay, I got a ride in his jet home for the weekend. I mean, that's what I'm talking about. That's fame. That's called wow. fame. That's kind of the job. So, you flew so what did I do? Jet. I went to the mall and I bought a ridiculous designer bag. Like, like I got to be this person now to go on the jet. With Harrison. I spent all this money. Nobody cared. It was like him and a pilot. I didn't talk to Harrison. He was in the front. I was in the back alone with my designer bag. <laughs> like, <laughs> we out here. <laughs> like, nobody, nobody cared. No. Uh, and then later, at the premiere of the movie, 
everybody, I'm embarrassed to say this. This is what happened, though. Tell me. This is a reveal. Mm -hmm. Because everybody's celebrating the movie. Of course. And I thought, you know, he's got a lot of yes people around him. And I'm going to be real with him. <laughs> but why do you I'm think gonna, that you have to do this? I don't know. Mary Lynn, this is like, listen, let, let someone else listen. do this. You have, Everybody's like, oh, this movie. I'm so embarrassed. I went up to him. <laughs> I'm so embarrassed. And I whispered in his ear, the movie's OK. <laughs> uh, why, do you have, why do you have to do stuff like that? Why do you, well, you can't stop yourself? <laughs> and what did he react? What did he say to you? Nothing. He just went blank, and I hope he immediately forgot about it. And I don't know why I'm bringing it up now. It was not a good move on my no, part. So, have you seen him since? No. <laughs> well, if Harrison... He hasn't had me on his plane ever since then. <laughs> ever since that. I want to talk about the famous comedy tour, because uh, that's how I first uh, got to know you. I saw you do uh, stand-up. And yes. you're very, very funny. You're going to be, uh, you're going to be back here in New York City, August 26th to the 27th. The Carolines, shout out to Carolines, I love that. But Providence, Rhode Island. Uh, you're in Austin, Texas, uh, and you're, you're famous. You're fame-ish. You have a book out that people can go buy and purchase and hold and snuggle right here. Famous. Touch it. Get it. Yes. Go see Famous the Comedy Tour. Go to Marilyn Marilyn dot com. Marilyn Rice Cub, everybody. Famous My Life at the Edge of Stardom is out now. Hey, hey, hey.